in physical exam now we spend most of our time with palpation and with auscultation um, and uh, visual findings, right? But um, historically we use a lot of other senses, so you use things like what? What have we done that's outside of those three senses? Smell. Yeah, so what do we smell? Uh, like for diabetics, you can smell their breath. Right, so you can actually smell people's breaths with, with liver disease too, you remember what that's called? Hepaticus, good. What's that? So what does that smell? I'm so it's honestly it's hard. A lot of folks will have you know bad teeth, that sort of thing when they come in with especially alcohol sources. But um, <laughs> um, but uh, it is supposed to smell like kind of a rotten yeast. So it's called it's caused by dimethyl sulfur or something. Dimethyl, dimethyl sulfoxide or something like that. It's a sulfur-based compound, and it's actually a sign of portal hypertension. So anything that causes portal hypertension basically bypasses the liver, just like ammonia and like everything else. And it, so I don't know. I don't know any values on that. He didn't, he didn't cite any like lid ratios or anything, but probably useful, maybe useful. Most likely, you're going to see other findings if you see that. Um, so good. Uh, so there's been a proposition that you might be able to smell Billy Ribbon too. So. <laughs> If you just so it's actually not even all that unpleasant. It's sort of like burnt toast and it's like a food odor, like butternut squash. I don't know really what it is, but it smells. There's a smell there. Um, so do you guys want to just take a take a quick smell? See if you smell it. <laughs> it's pretty subtle, and I think it's one of those things you can roar dark a little bit. Can you smell anything? No, okay. not really. Go ahead. <laughs> Did you wash your face recently? Um, okay, that's great. It's yeah. probably a healthy thing to do. Yeah. <laughs> <laughs> Alright, so um, what other senses have we used? You mentioned diabetes. Uh, yes, I did. Taste. Yeah, so what happened when you got to, I mean, people don't like to think about this, but when you got to a glucose of over 180, right, what do you do with urine? Dump glucose. Dump glucose. Taste. Yeah. So, um, you know, you have to evaporate the, to smell. Um, so one of the things that um, some people are suggesting and it makes some people uncomfortable is that you actually taste. So just... Twin smell, and then you can, can she wash your face, that's helpful. We're not going to look Are you, are you feeling uncomfortable with this? You're okay? Yeah. You're a little bit? <laughs> so, um, so you can actually like, lick a little bit. You okay? <laughs> Sorry. So, does anybody else want to? No. Okay, <laughs> so, what if you were to consider like the day of the month it was? Yeah. Yeah. What if you were to consider that? Uh -huh. Would you? Would you do that? <laughs> this is my friend Catherine. Hi. Say hi. <laughs> yeah, you guys all passed the sociological exam. So I, should, I would not do that. That's awesome. <laughs> so this is sort of a tradition I'm trying to do here. <laughs> Did you all just all of a sudden hate me for a second? 